Mwili wangu Mali ya God 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 Okay praise the Lord Amen Praise the Lord Amen Tumekuja kusema mwili wangu Mali ya God Mwili wangu Mali ya God Nikachunguka kiwa Kabichi Nikachunguka kiwa Kabichi Hallelujah it is yet another moment that we are gathered here as the advocacy team Christian Union Chuka University tulisema leo lazima wajue nikachungu kakiwa kabichi we, are, we thank the Lord for the fight he has been amazing moment we have preached to many and we say thank you to him allow me at this moment to welcome my sister and she shares something small yeah. praise Jesus yeah. mwili wangu mali ya God mwili wangu Yes, mwili wangu mali ya God. My name is Julian. I'm an advocate for sexual purity and we are here as the Christian Union Chuka University advocating for sexual purity. Mwili wangu mali ya God. Mwili wangu mali ya God. Abstinence is cool. Joseph did it. Please, you can also do it. Mwili wangu mali ya God. Mwili wangu mali ya God. Yes, and we are here as the advocates. We are saying that any sin that is uh, done outside the body but any sin that is done inside the body is sex so flee from sexual purity flee from immorality flee 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 toroka 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 haya 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 mwili yangu mwili yangu hey 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 hey, hey. Yes 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 yes. Katesi of Chuka University Christian Union tunasema mwili yangu We still advocating for sexual purity that we ought to remain pure until marriage. Tunasema we remain pure until marriage. Ukiona sex unafanya nini? Unamurife, unafanya nini? Unamurife. Thank you very much. I'm Maina Braya. Mwili wangu Mwili wangu Mali ya God I'm Chichi Tebla um, I'm advocating for sexual purity As we've been told by those who've just spoken before me uh, The only sin that you commit inside your body is sexual sin Praise God Amen. And it is only uh, sexual sin where you get uh, yourself attaching yourself to sexual ties and things that will affect you for a lifetime when you just sleep with a person you you think you are doing it for fun but what they go through will also affect you that is why we are advocating that as students and even as youths we should stand out and wangu mwili wangu Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. So I'm Rachel Wanjiro advocating for sexual purity in Chuka University Christian Union. And I have one message for all of you guys. Our bodies are the temples of the Holy Spirit. So let's honor our bodies, okay? Yes. Make sure that you abstain. Make sure that you're free from sex till marriage, okay? So, mwili wangu. Mwili wangu. Keep that body pure. Promise? Yes. Yes. Thank you. Ah. Mwili wangu. Mali ya God. Mwili wangu. Mali ya God. So as you can see, uh, these are students from Chuka University. It's part of Chuka University Christian Union. These are them. We are here to advocate for uh, our purity. And uh, we are saying that it is easy by the grace of God. You see the Bible says in the book of Titus chapter 2 verse 11 that for the grace of God has appeared to all men teaching us to say not to ungodliness. So by this grace we will also be able to maintain our sexual purity. So it is our urge to all of us who are watching us in Chuka and uh, in the world in general that we we be to, uh, we be sexually pure because Jesus Christ is coming back so together as Chuka University Christian Union we are advocating for sexual purity let us maintain sexual purity before marriage and even after marriage mwili wangu mali ya god mwili wangu mali ya god mwili wangu mali ya god kama kama Smile. 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 Smile.
Yes, my name is Abraham Mlongo. I'm the chair of the Christian Union. I'm here to just advocate about chastity week. We are here to advocate for purity, which is part and parcel of us as Christians. And the Bible has been clear to us that the moment we mess up with our body, we mess up completely and we become, we become entangled to sin, which can become a, a great mess to our life, for our future. So we are here to advocate for the Christian, as a Christian union that purity is part and uh, parcel of us. And Mwiliwangu ni Mali Anani. And all the students that are watching over us today, we are urging them that let them keep themselves pure, abstain from cohabitation, abstain from every sexual, illicit uh, sexual immorality that they may stand for God. And also we call them that they may come to Christ because it's only Christ who can help us to live and to conquer this body because sometimes we can do it on our own but we fail but the moment we allow christ to become the epicenter of our life then we will be able to do what to conquer so i urge all the students please when you left your home here you are in school you are here your parents know that you have come to study so i want to urge you that abstain from every illicit kind of sexual impurity and stand for righteousness and wait because I know that God has set apart somebody for you and that person will only come if you have kept yourself pure and I know one thing is that the moment uh, God gives you what you deserve if you did not keep yourself pure then God will always allow you to be connected to somebody who is not pure but when you keep yourself pure God will connect the right person who will be for your future partner and that is what i want to urge you all keep yourself pure because god has called us to advocate for the same god bless you and do you good Amen. 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 thank you oh